So greetings from Pennsylvania once again, and yes, we have another covered bridge. We're still here in Chester County. We just did the uh, Raps Dam covered bridge, or the Raps covered bridge. Just a little bit, the ways over, that one was super busy. This one, not so much. <laughs> That's nicer. So we are here at the junction of French Creek Road and what's called Hollow Road. And here we go, the Sheeter Hall Covered Bridge. Sometimes just referred to as Hall's Covered Bridge. It is built in 1850, 100 feet long. This is the oldest existing bridge in Chester County. There were older ones, but it's the oldest one still standing, I guess you could say. It flows, it, uh, I was gonna say it flows over the French Creek. It goes over the French Creek, just like the other one we did today did. So let's go for a walk across this one. I think we can take our time on this one. The other one we visited today, we kind of had to rush through it. It's just so much traffic coming through, but wow, beautiful stream. This is French Creek, just like over at the other bridge. Beautiful spot, I'll tell you what. All right, and once again, you can see our friend the Burr Arch Truss, and this one, just like Rapp's covered bridge, it's got the, the double Burr Arch. You can see some stuff has been replaced. This looks new right here, compared to the rest of the wood on here. So there's some rehabilitation work that's been done. All right, a few cars coming through, but even over here, you can see this, is, this, this whole post right here is new. And other places they have, like this right, part here is new but they've kind of grafted it into an older beam you can kind of see the difference this has a old even feel to it this is the newer one so that's cool instead of replacing the whole thing they left they're leaving as much of the original as they can even over here you can see they did the same thing here's an older piece they kind of grafted it in with a newer piece down below here So traffic is picking up on this bridge. But over here, you can see it, it happened over here too. Just kind of, I, I like that idea. Instead, I like the idea of leaving as much of the original as possible. Maybe some of the stuff close to the bottom was getting a little more rotten out. Rotted out. Of course, these are all new too. Then. Yeah, some of the older beams, like this, these are new. This is all new right here. Most of this one is, but here you can see the new, and you can clearly see where the older, the original material is. They kind of bolted it together. Okay, so we're gonna head across the bridge again. Like I said, it's getting a little more busier than it was when I first got here, but still nowhere near as busy as Raps Covered Bridge was, the one we did earlier. Then we're gonna try and make our way down to either side of the creek and get some views from the side. See if we can get some cool, shots from down below and check out the underneath the bridge too still haven't gotten that you know i like the other one i like to get a shot of the bridge you know all in one frame from the side we should be able to get that down there i'm walking across without showing you the bridge <laughs> all right there you go let's take one last look back through so there's a lot of new stuff on here too but they're preserving as much as possible like even there you can see how there's the old there's the new one last look down through. All right, we'll make our way down to this side of the creek first. So you can see the bridge. Uh, okay, this one does have some steel, some steel girders as well. All right, so this side is in the shade, but I'm still gonna maybe go upstream just a little bit, see if I can get a, a long shot of it. Then we'll head to the other side. It's kind of cool hearing the cars go across too. All right, well, that's kind of the best shot I'm gonna get on this side. The bridge, I think the other side will be more in the sun. So let's try to get over there, but it's still a cool shot. Got the whole bridge in the frame there. Just heading down the other side. All right, we're gonna have to get a little bit further away to get. Well, that's kind of that's not a bad shot there, but like something a little bit. Well, we'll see. All right, so there's a trail that goes further back this way. 
Let's see if we can get the bridge from a different perspective. Some fishing trails, it looks like. Yeah, because I'd like to get it from that perspective without all the trees in the way. I think we're going to get just what we want, actually. Wow. Like you see the bridge reflecting off, that's a that's cool right there. The bridge is reflecting off the water. Yeah, this might just be one of my favorite bridge pictures here, covered bridge pictures. You got the beautiful red bridge across the, the creek, the French creek here, and you got the, the reflection of it in the water down below. That is pretty awesome. Yeah, it's a beautiful area down here. I got a quick run up to, run up to the Jeep then and get my phone. Take a picture of that with my, with my phone then. Left it in the Jeep. Yeah, but just nice down here. Probably the, my most favorite place we've visited today so far. I should say today is September 2nd. We're in September now. That, that is just amazing right there. Yeah, it's a beautiful view out there. It even matches my shirt. See the reflection down below. That's pretty cool. Yeah, so just man, get out there, explore. You never know what you're going to find. Find beautiful stuff like this. All right, but you know, we're going to end this video. We're going to hop back in Naomi, who's waiting up there for us. And we're going to drive across the bridge together. As you know, that's her favorite part. So I will see you as we head across. All right, so here we go then. Naomi's favorite part. Let's go make sure everyone's coming across. Oh, we got someone coming off to her left though. All right, now we can go across, I think. Make sure no one's coming. Kind of blind turn here. There we go. Sheeter Hall covered bridge. Another beautiful, another beautiful one. All right, folks, that's it. As always, thanks for coming along and uh, we'll see you on the next one, hopefully. Time to go home. <laughs>